is a little rock planet of a really nice guy. to Zoe, Billy, Polly, and Oli present the history of the Roly-Poly Planet. Part 1. Rocketing around the universe. Ouch! <laughs> <clears throat> Once a long time ago on a planet far, far away, there was a disaster. No ice cream. One super brave bot decided to help his fellow bots. He was Captain Space Barnacle Boxy. Captain Space Barnacle Boxy. <laughs> Billy, it's your turn. Captain Space Barnacle Boxy. <clears throat> I will find a new route. Your rocket! What, Oli? Your rocket! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Captain Space Barnacle Boxy! <laughs> I will find a new route to the ice cream planet! Blast <laughs> Back in the old days, we Rockets were small and clunky. They were always in danger of getting hit by asteroids! Whoa! Asteroids! We're gonna crash! We have to find a planet to land on! We're safe! And that's how the roly-poly planet was discovered because Captain Space Barnacle Boxy was searching for ice cream. I claim this planet in the name of... Whoa! Whoa! Ah! Oh. <laughs> Part two, electricity. Way, way long ago, all we bots were powered by springs and wind-up keys. No bot could go too far from home because the springs would wind down and the bot would run out of power really fast. <laughs> All that was changed by... Dr. Cranky Cookie. Is that a zitchy? <laughs> See the Dr. Cranky Cookie lines. I, Dr. Cranky Cookie, will capture electricity from the clouds and use it to, to, uh, um, uh, to power bots. To power bots everywhere. Now all I need is a storm. Thanks, Polly. <laughs> <laughs> Here come the star Stormy Stormy. Ha, 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 I'm Stormy. And you can't catch my lightning! Oh, yeah? Yeah! Ha, ha, ha! That oh, one, that, that one, take that! that. Ha, ha, yourself! Now I have enough electricity to superpower bots all over the roly-poly planet. Oh, yeah? Well, take this! 
Gee, that feels much better. Thanks. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> Wait, Zoe, I'm not finished my part yet. <laughs> Zoe, forget it. Let's just keep going. You'll be the announcer guy now. Part three, the trailblazing, um, trailblazers. Now the bots had all the power they needed. Um, um, all the power they needed. <coughs> to explore the roly-poly planet. Yeah! They had all the power they needed to explore the roly-poly planet. They could keep going and going and going. We're going to circle the whole planet and make sure it's safe for families to settle. Let's go. Zoe. Okie dokie, Oli. Look, Trailblazer Oli, a forest. Age of Invention. As families settled the roly-poly planet, they built all kinds of neato, spiffy things. Whoa! Farmers use pogo planters to have fun while planting seeds in their fields. Zoom! Zoom! People all over the roly-poly planet could send all kinds of stuff to each other with robo-mail rockets. They could send comic books or trading cards they could even send letters to Clanky Claus. Zoom! Zoom! <laughs> Robo doctors invented all kinds of super cool medicines to keep Bot safe from the rusty mumps and the blue botic itchies. <laughs> this won't taste bad at all, Spot. <laughs> In cities, city bots began putting up big high scrapers. Right, Builder Zoe? Righty, righty, Polly. The empirical block building was one of the biggest and most beautiful ever built. Beautiful, beautiful. Spot, no. Uh -oh. Spot, no, spot. <laughs> and that's how the roly-poly planet was discovered and bravely settled. And what's going to happen in the new age? Anything's possible in the roly-poly world. Maybe we'll find a totally ice cream planet. Maybe we'll even find other people. Somewhere out there. Maybe we'll even find you. Blast off! <laughs> Challenges the Cosmic Cube to a game of Space Tag. Okie dokie. You're it. Like somebody's gears are grinding. Fun time means fair time, you dig? But I tagged him in. Oh, you wouldn't understand. It's Space Boy and Cosmic Cube stuff. Wouldn't understand? <laughs> <laughs> Why, I practically invented Space Rangers. Ditto, Daddy O. They had games way back then? 
When I was a young boy, I was the speediest space ranger in the whole world of round. When I was just a peg, I was the quickest cosmic cube in the four corners of the galaxy. Yeehaw! <laughs> <laughs> well, did you have an emergency eject as you spun out of control towards an alien-occupied space station? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> well, with gravity-defying magno boots, you just moonwalk out of harm's way. Wow! Yay, Dad! You might have magno but I was faster. No, no, Daddy-o. Was too. Our dads are acting kind of silly. Yeah. Space tank? You're on. And you're it. Slow-mo, Daddy-o. You're it. Not for long. Our dads are way out wild and cosmic cool. You're it, Percy. You're it, Baxter. You're it. Ha ha! Any sign of them? Cosmic Cube is in position. Space Dad approaching. Sneaky square. I didn't think grown ups had this much fun in them. Naha, got you. <laughs> Your magno boots can't help you now. How long do you think they can keep going? You've met your match, Space Bud! Pretty long. You cannot escape the Cosmic Cube! Tossed a rod. 
missed me. Did not, Comic Cube. No way, Space Toy. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh. Dad, you have Mr. Bevel go boom. Hiya, sweetums. Hello, Baxter. Oh, <laughs> hello, honey. Uh, we were just um, showing the boys how to uh, uh, play fair. <laughs> Looks like playtime is over, uh, so we'll uh, just tidy up. <laughs> You're in space, dot, and not astronaut. Ah, too. Meteor mouth, potato brain, cosmic clown. <laughs> we might not know who the fastest space tagger is, but we sure know who the bestest dads are. Yeah! Extra special gray today. <gasps> oh. <sighs> These gray blahs of ground gears I didn't even know I had. Me too. <sighs> Luckily, it's the last gray day for a while. Last day? That's right, Zoe. When Comet Silius comes, it's Silly Willy Day. The bestest, brightest, blue skyest day of the whole year. Everything and everyone acts their super silly illiest. Comet silliest tickles our funny bone, so we laugh the gray <laughs> away and feel good all over. And all the color comes back into our world. <gasps> oh. We get silly willies all day, till the Flora Nova comes. It makes the silly willies go away. Got the silly willies. Colors are back. Bright as ever. I feel silly. I feel silly. Silly, silly, silly. <laughs> Spot, you're so silly, it's alarming. Happy Silly Willy Day! And boy, do I feel silly today. Silly, silly, silly! So silly that I'm gonna try and walk on my hands all day just for fun. I am talking just like Daddy. Well, bounce me round, Oli. You silly. And boy, me feel silly too. That's cause it's <laughs> Silly Willy Day! It's a silly willy day. <laughs> you silly daddy. Yeah, that sounds just like me. Boy, are we feeling silly today? Get your better ready, buddy, 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 breakfast bolts. Get your better ready, buddy, 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 breakfast bolts. Breakfast is ready. Charge! Woo -hoo -hoo! Ice cream 
smooth the rules. Now that's a silly breakfast. I'll have two scoops. <laughs> Okie dokie. <laughs> <laughs> two, two, two! <laughs> oh my! What a silly mess! Guess we'll just have to leave it! Charge! <laughs> Baby buggy bumpers. <laughs> hey, that sounds like me, a silly pooch. Ooh, time for the silly Willy's dance a I call this the silly Willy quick kick. I prefer the silly Willy wiggle wiggle wacky woo hoo. How about the silly Willy Piccadilly? Silly Willies. We laughed all the gray away. That was the silly Willies day ever. Even the stars are smiling. Silly, silly, silly. Way up high in the roly poly sky is a little round planet of a really nice guy. Jiffy, Mr. Sunny. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Puffy, what you doing? Why, it's Mr. Sonny's totally clipsorama day, Oli. <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> Come back here. Totally oh. clipple. What? <laughs> uh, Eclipsorama Day. What doing, Pappy? <laughs> <laughs> it's Mr. Sonny's Totally Eclipsorama Day, Zo. Ooh, Total Eclipse Mama Day. We better get dressed. Oh, nokie dokie. Eclipsorama Day is an all pajama day. Yay! Hooray! A pajama bonanza! <laughs> <laughs> Why is it an all pajama day, Pappy? Cause on Eclipsorama Day, it's nighttime in the middle of the day. Nighttime? No, Mr. Sunny? Nope. He's gonna say night night for a while. So what exactly is Mr. Sunny's total Eclipsorama Day? <laughs> I'll show you. <laughs> <laughs> now, let's pretend Oli is Planet Poli, floating out in the middle of space. Hmm. Like this, Pappy? <laughs> exactly. And Flashy here is Mr. Sunny grinning down on Planet O. Yeah, I mean Planet Poli. What me, Pappy? What me? <laughs> and you, Sweet Pea, are the very pretty Moony. Pretty Mooney, pretty Mooney. Now, on a totally <laughs> Clipsorama day, Mooney moves in to cut a rug with Mr. Sunny. She squeezes right between Mr. Sunny and Planet Polly. <laughs> hey, it got dark. <laughs> right in the middle of the day. You see, Eclipsorama days are extra special. They only happen every uh, bazillion years or so. Wow. So what do we do now, Pappy? Well, the same thing you do any night before you go to bed. Only we're gonna stay up all night long. Hooray! <laughs> Flashlights, how's about the sleeping bags? Got them. Got them. Welding masks? What do we need welding masks for? Oh, cuz, even though Mr. Sonny's hiding behind Mooney, he can still hurt your eyes if you look right at him. This'll keep your eyes safe. Well, looks like we're all set. Let's blow up Tinny. <laughs> Hey guys, what you doing? We're camping out with Pappy for Mr. Sonny's Total Eclipsorama Day. Sounds celestial. All right, it's countdown time. Ten, Ten nine, nine, two, eight, eight seven, 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 six, six five, five, four, four three, two, one. Neato! <laughs> Me scared. It's okay, Zoe. It's just the way the world's gears turn. <laughs> All right, let's hop to it. We got to cram a whole night's worth of stuff into just a little while. See you in the morning. Night, night, Daddy. Me stay up all night. <laughs> Look, Housie's fallen asleep. Come on, let's see what Chili and the other house buddies do at night. I always wondered what that noise was. Gotcha now! <laughs> Got ya! <laughs> Go sleepy! <laughs> <laughs> Time for a little flashlight tag. Tag 
Yeah, you're it. <laughs> <laughs> you're on. This night's almost over. Already? Yeah. Time to hop into old Teddy here and wait for Mr. Sonny to come back out. This was the bestest day ever, Pappy. Um, <laughs> I mean night. <laughs> Whoop. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> Well, Mr. Sonny and Mooney are all done dancing. At least for another bazillion years. <laughs> you know, I'm sure glad I got to share this Eclipse-a-rama with my two favorite bots. Me too, Pappy. Yeah! Hey! Breakfast time! But it's the middle of the day. <laughs> yeah, but Mr. Sonny just came up. Yay, Rolly! I guess I must have nodded off. <laughs> you were snoring as loud as a diesel engine. <laughs> <laughs> so, how was the old Eclipsorama? Mr. Sunny and Mooney danced, danced, dancey. It was swell. Thanks to Pappy, we'll never forget it. Not for a bazillion years. Why don't you try mine? <gasps> Sorry, my Sorry, bye. <laughs> Uh-oh, we have a little problem. The bike's a bit too big. Oh. Well, if we can't move the pedals up, we'll just move you down. There. Ready, Zoe? Go, go! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so we look Oh <laughs> Big bike fun You almost had it that time Zo. Ready for another try? So we ready try Hey What's all the commotion, kids? Uh, sounded like a meteor landed in the backyard. That was Zoe. She's learning how to ride my two-wheel. Oh, two-wheeler, huh? Big bike, big noise! <laughs> you know, you're a fine <laughs> bot for trying to help your sister out, Oli. But uh, I think that it'd be better if a grown-up were to teach her how to ride. And there's nobody more grown up than me. Wow, you can ride a bike, Pappy? I've been riding bikes since before they invented two wheelers. Why, I only had a one wheeler. <gasps> wow, one wheel only? Yippee! <laughs> yeah wow, look at Pappy go. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> First tip is, don't look down at the wheel. Look where you're going. Hey! Whoa! Always lean into the turns. Oh! Whoa! I might not have it. Hang on to your hinges, though. I've got a few more tips for you. Just as soon as I remember how to kick off this thing. Hi, Uncle Gary. 
Well, howdy, bots. Uh, say, uh, was that Pappy I just saw roll by? Pappy, zoom, zoom, crash. <laughs> A zoom, zoom, crash, huh? huh? So, what's new with you two, anywho? Me learn ride big bikes like Oli and Uncle Giz. Well, that's capital T, a terrific. Seems like you're growing up mighty fast, kiddo. So we want to go fast. Zoom, 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 zoom. Pappy was giving Zoom lessons, but he kind of got carried away. No problemo. Who knows more about riding two-wheelers than the gills? Want me to hold the bike while you... Now cool your pistons a sec. I think Zoe could use a little backyard testing first. Okie dokie. Okie dokie, young kids. Oh, you see, balancing's uh, tricky, so, uh, but you see, I, uh, I rode the waves with the great gear Huna, so, so, ah, uh, <laughs> well, you, you see, uh, you might not get it first time, but if you stick with it, <laughs> hey. <laughs> Balance, check. Woo! Sure looks like little Zoe knows how to ride a wave, Dave. Well, how's my little reflex test with the old boinky here? <laughs> Woo! Yeah! Reflexes. Check. Hmm. Well, let's measure your kicking capacity, kiddo. Leg strength. Checkity check. Man, oh man, those are some high-powered springs you got there. <laughs> now so we ride big bike. Well, hang on now. We haven't done a, an eye test. Yeah, that's it. Got to see if them peepers are keepers. <sighs> Peeper test too, Uncle Giz. Test your peepers for what, Pumpkin? <sighs> so Zoe can ride my bike. Uncle Giz is helping her get ready. That's awful nice of you, Giz. Are you sure you're ready to ride a big bike, Zoe? So we're ready now! Not just yet, Pumpkin. A big bike can mean big bumps. That means a big pattern for my little girl. Oh. There. Now you'll be safe and sound. I can't hear you, Zoe. <sighs> so we ride big bike now, Wally? How's about a proud poly grin? <laughs> Gotta have some footage of this for the poly archives. Oh. Orbs up, everybody! <laughs> Whoa, welcome! Oh, <laughs> Goodness! Great rolling donuts. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm fine. Yeah, I was just showing Zoe a thing or two about bicycle riding. <laughs> Zoe's got an old one. Balance, whoa, 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 is the key. Let's not forget about keeping both eyes front and your knees pumping. <laughs> Zoe's not going anywhere till I give that two-wheeler a tip-top tune-up. Safety first, though. She needs more padding. She has to hold her antenna straight, too. Ready to give it another try, Zoe? So we ready. So we ready long time. <laughs> I think Zoe should try some altitude training on the trampoline. And then she can start her stretching exercises. How about some training wheels? Just two or three sets ought to do it. Ooh, this might give her just a wee bit more protection. <laughs> ride, ride, ride! <laughs> Way to go, Zoe! <laughs> oh, 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 what do you know? Nice oh, going, oh. Zoe. <laughs> <laughs> You did it, Zoe! Big bike, big fun, fun, fun! <laughs> <sighs> well, I guess the hardest part of teaching your little bot to ride is learning to let go. <laughs> 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 Ah, 
Everyone ready for Oli's big winky ball game? Can't wait, Pappy. It's gonna be one Jim Dandy of a game. So, where's the little superstar? Oli's upstairs. He's not ready yet. You better throw it into gear, boy. Time's a wasting. Well, what you doing just sitting around? Today's the biggest winky ball game yet. I know. Oh. Why the gloomy Gus? I don't want to play in today's big winky ball game. What? I've been winked the last 15 games straight. I don't want Mom and Dad to see me wink out again. Well, that's one wicked winky ball slump, all right. Yeah. Almost as bad as your dad's. Mine's not the longest winky ball slump in history. Oh, <laughs> you're not even close, Oli. Yeah. Let me tell you the story of Mighty Percy. Huh. Now that was a slump. The outlook wasn't sunny for the Poli Villers that day. It was a five to two score with but one round to play. But hope still flowed through the Poliville crowd. They cheered their winkers with voices quite loud. Come on, Gizzy! You can do it! Giz had scored both of the winks that day. And despite the score, things still seemed okay. Gizmo dug in and got good and ready, holding his racket ever so steady. And with one mighty swing, you could hear the air sing. That winky ball went a hurtling away. Giz whacked that ball into a whole other day. Gizmo skated like a robot possessed. But that winky ball, well, it just wouldn't rest. Gizmo touched one wink, then two winks, then he touched three. Go, Gizzy, go! Gizmo was going to win the game. It was plain to see. Then the unthinkable was think. Whoa! And suddenly, Gizmo was winked. Oh, no! Gizzy! He got winked? He lost all his points? Yep, he got winked. So what happened next? There was only one little winker left to play. About little Percy, there's not much you could say. It's your turn up, Percy. Go on out there and give that winky ball a whirl. It's five to two. There's no way I could get a four-point super wink. I'm in a slump. I don't want to let everyone down again. Hey. As long as you keep trying and trying and trying your very best, you'll never let anyone down. You can do it, Perse. Just keep your eye on the winky ball. Getting a super wink filled little Percy with doubt. And that winky ball chuckled. <laughs> this was a sure winky out. Now, you won't find this next part in any old book. It was too much to take. The crowd couldn't look. Oh, oh. The crowd roared to life. We were so proud. Everyone shouted and cheered out and cried right out loud. Skate, Percy! Go, go, go! There was shining excitement on everyone's faces. And little Percy was off to the races. Little Percy dodged, ducked, and rolled. He was awesome. He just wouldn't fold. Go, Percy! All right, little brother! Little Percy was sure to get winked. That we all reckoned. Instead, 
He rocketed straight to that winky in second. What happened next, Pappy? <laughs> Jumpin' Jiminy. The winky ball had him now, we all concurred. But Percy jumped, juked, and jived his way onto third. Yeah, Percy! All right! <laughs> yeah! He's trying to win the game! Gee whiz! He went for the super wink? Darn tootin'. There was much joy in Polyville, I'm here to say. For Mighty Percy won the big game that day. Hooray! Dad won the game! That's right. But you know the thing I was proudest of wasn't that he won the game and broke his slump, but that he got up there and tried one more time. Come on, Ollie! You can do it! Uh-oh. Gotcha! Yeah! Hooray! Yeah! You've got the super win, Goalie. I knew you could do it. Hooray! Yeah! Jump and Jupiter's only. Where'd you learn all those fancy moves? And there was much joy in Polyville, we're all here to say. For Mighty Oli won the big game that day. Way up high in the roly poly sky is a little round. Of a really nice guy. He's roly poly yoli. He's small and smart and round. And in the land of curves and curls, he's the swellest kid around. Howdy, howdy, hooray, hooray. And in the land of curves and curls, he's the swellest kid around. We have to be careful, Space Dog. The evil Astro Blaster could be anywhere around here. Aha! Uh -huh. I've got you now, Space Boy. Feel my Astro Power. Once again, Space Boy, the ultimate hero, saves the day. Remember the Space Boy motto, I did my best and that's the best I can do. It's so cool re-pretending our favorite Space Boy shows. Now let's do the one where he saves Planet Chillsville from Comet Hotsy Topsy. Yeah, right after we finish watching the new Space Boy episode. After Burners, don't fail me now! Yes, Space Cadets, it's time for the amazing adventures of our favorite intergalactic guy, Space Boy! Yeah! <laughs> Great job, Space Dog. I don't think those super crusher giant robots will trouble us ever again. Yep, we did our best. That's the, the best, best we, we can do. do. Yay! Wow, what a show! And now, stay tuned for a special message from Space Boy. 
Howdy, faithful viewers on planet Poli. Space Dog and I have something important to tell you. This is going to be my last Space Boy show in this galaxy. <gasps> what? You see, there's danger lurking everywhere in the universe. So we'll be rocketing to another galaxy where other kids need our help. Thanks a million to all you Space Boy and Space Dog fans. We'll, we'll miss you, and we'll always remember you. So don't ever forget the Space Boy motto. Always do your best, because that's the best you can do. <laughs> Space Boy ever again? <gasps> what are we gonna do? I just feel rotten. Me too. Not only did he have a great show, but he was a great pal. I wish there was some way we could say goodbye to him. <sighs> Me too. Hey! Wait here! I'll be right back! Mom! Mom! What's all the hullabaloo, Wooly? Mom, can I use the phone to call the Space Boy helpline? It's important! Sure, sweetie. Space Boy helpline, will you hold, please? No, wait! This is Oli Poli from Polyville, and I really, really need to get a hold of Space Boy. It's important. Oli Poli? Oh, we remember you. Space Boy's off to another galaxy already, but we'll do our bestest to get him the message. Thanks. And, um, can you just tell him that we'll always do our best, because that's the best we can do? <sighs> Are you okie dokie, Oli? I just wanted to say goodbye to Space Boy before he goes, but he's long gone by now. Space Boy! I just received an urgent call from Oli Poli in Polyville. And it sounds like, I don't know, it sounds like an emergency. You're right, Space Dog. We better go back and help our good friend Oli Poli. Does somebody here need a helping hand? Space Boy, Space Dog, you came. I thought I'd never see you again. We rocketed over as soon as we heard you were in trouble. Uh, thanks, Space Boy, but I'm not... So, is it the rust monster? <laughs> I'll use my rust detector to find him. There's no rust monster, Space Boy. You're right. No sign of the rust monster here. Is it the evil Astro Blaster? I better check this out. It's not the evil Astro Blaster either. Then, what's the trouble, Oli? Well, there's not really any danger here, Space Boy. Didn't you call for help? No, I called because um, I just wanted to say, you know, to say goodbye. Oh, saying goodbye is pretty important. Billy and I can't believe we're never ever going to see you again. Oh no, Billy, I left him in the park. <gasps> Whoa! Space Boy! You're here! You came! Hey, I had to say goodbye to my two bestest space pals. Do you really have to go, Space Boy? I'm afraid so, Billy. But why? It's just time to move on. Space Boy! Come in, Space Boy! We have an emergency! Little Gabby in the Galaxy in a Galaxy really needs your help! It sounds like little Gabby's in trouble. Well, I guess this is it. We're sure gonna miss you, Space Boy. I don't know what we're gonna do without you. Yeah, you do, Oli. Just remember to do your best. Because that's, that's the best, best we can, can do. do. <laughs> that's right. Because you know, there's a little hero in every one of us. Help, Oli! Help, Billy! Help, Space Boy! <laughs> I think you and Billy can handle this one. Afterburners, don't fail me now! <laughs> Zoe, 
It's Space Boy Oli and Space Boy Billy to the rescue! Boy, it's really high up there. Uh-huh. Hey, remember that time when Space Boy and Space Dog rescued the princess from the icky space spiders? Yeah! Huh? Up, up, <laughs> and away! Gotcha! Whoa! <laughs> Here you go, Zoe. Thank you, Oli. Thank you, Billy. It looks like Space Boy was right. There is a little hero in all of us. Yeah! Afterburners don't fail us now! Vroom. <laughs> There's O. What's got my little girl in such a whirl? Party, party, party! <laughs> oh, come on, pumpkin. Just let me put your bow on. Ready, bow? For Binky birthday. <laughs> Binky's birthday, huh? That is exciting. <laughs> What you doing with the pirate gear, Oli? Is Binky's birthday a dress-up party? Okie dokie, Dad. This stuff is for me and Belly after the party. Oh? Yep. We're big bots now. Too big to play at a little kid's party. That's why we're in charge of the games and the craft table. Is that so? Once the little bots are tired out, Billy and I are gonna play pirates. Alrighty. You want to be in charge of fun and games? It can be a lot of work. No problem, oh Dad. Binky and Zoe are just little bots. Sure. They'll be having naps in no time. Then Billy and me are going to play pirates. Arr! Happy birthday, Binky! Happy birthday, Binky. What do you want to do first? <gasps> yeah, my yeah! <laughs> this is the flag for Bevel Square Flag Tag. You stick the flag on the back of your pants and everybody has to try and grab it. Tag, tag, tag! Okie dokie, who wants the flag? <laughs> everybody get Binky! Go get him, Zoe! Well, look at her go! <laughs> <laughs> Sure is fast for a little boy. Yeah. I guess we gotta keep our orbs and blocks up. Huh, Oli? You betcha. Flag, flag, flag <laughs> Zoe wins! <laughs> At least for one game and one diaper down. My love was at what? Here's the birthday boy, re-diapered and ready for any angle you boys can throw at him. <laughs> oh, oh, <yeah. laughs> Sure I can't be of any help, Billy Boy? Well, if you really want to, there is something you can do, Mom. Ready for musical squares? When the music stops, you gotta sit on a square. If you don't grab a square, you're out of there. <laughs> <laughs> Let's show them how it's done, Oleo. <laughs> On. Let's play again. <laughs> play, play, play.
Trizo. You almost pinned the antenna on the robot. <laughs> Let's see how you do, Binky. Careful, that thing's really sticky. <laughs> oh, Binky. You got win? I don't know if you won, Binky, but I sure lost. <sighs> These little bot games are pretty fun for them. Sure. They're winning everything, but they don't seem to be getting tired. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> What's he up to now? Papa, what up? Yeah, my Jersey! <laughs> it's follow the binky. But you little bots look like you could use a rest. So let's do some finger painting. Yay! Pay, pay, pay! This was a good idea. They need their quiet time. Yep, all that running around takes a lot out of little bots. Yay! Pay, pay, pay! Hey. We're supposed to paint the paper, not each other. This is a real nokey dokey zo. Look at your party dress. If you two bought can't behave. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, cut that out. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> <laughs> Okie dokie, Binky. Time to unlock the birthday boxes. <laughs> oh, a spaceman's helmet from your big brother, Billy. Yeah. That's from Zoe and me. <laughs> and those are from Daddy and me for our littlest block. You two did a real square job keeping the kids entertained. Thanks, Dad. But it was sort of the other way around. So, are you sailing off to play Big Bot Pirates now? Yeah. <laughs> 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 and miss out on another game of Follow the Binky? <laughs> no, no way! <laughs> <laughs> Guess I have to find somebody else to play with. Howdy, Dad. Wanna play some hide and seek? Okie dokie, Ole. Just a nanosec while I set the magno for a little paint disappearing. Gotta get rid of that blue stain. Ooh, hey, whoa! Um, blue stain's gone, Dad. Huh? This might take a little while. Maybe you should ask Mom to play. Hey, Mom. Wanna play hide and seek? In a minute, sweetie. I have to get these plants in the ground before their roots rust. Okie dokie. Hmm, maybe Pappy will play with you. Nothing. Nobody wants to play hide and seek with me. Don't we play hidey seek? 
Only no find me. No key dokey, Zoe. I want to play a big ball game of hide and seek. So we play big ball hide and seek. But so you're too easy to find. And you tell me where you are before I even look. That's not fun for big bots like me. So we fun. Only count one, four, two, ten. Okie dokie. But you have to hide really good. Yep. <laughs> one, two, three. Me hide here. Only find Zoe. <laughs> Zoe, you have to play big bot hide and seek. Okie dokie. Okie dokie, Oli. You're gonna hide really good and stay quiet till I find you? Me promise. Okie dokie, here goes. One, two. Oh three, no! Four, Indigo! Five, six, hmm. seven, <laughs> Ready or not, here I come. Me ready, Oli. Shh. Remember, big bot hide and seek. Aha. Uh -huh. Hmm. Aha. Uh -huh. Hmm. Uh-oh. Oli no see me. So? Gotcha. Nope. You're hiding good, Zoe. Only you no see me? Ooh, me no see me. I gotcha. Uh-uh. What are you up to, Oli? Zoe and I are playing hide-and-seek. Have you seen her? Nope. Okie dokie. There, that about does it. Just have to spread the last few seeds. Huh? Oh, my. Where are you, Zoe? Come on! Aha! <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> Zoe. Only no find me here. <laughs> What a dream. Ah, the, the pillows were flying. Ah. Oh, well. I'll be jiggered. Uh -huh. Aha! <laughs> nope. Zoe! Yes! If I tighten the tone tuner... Now, where'd I put that screwdriver? Oh, thanks. Huh? <laughs> Anybody seen Zoe? Zoe, I'm not having fun anymore. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Whoa. Hide is big, fun, fun, funny. Zoe? Shh, Oli, me hiding. Zoe? Is that you? Zoe, are you invisible? <laughs> no tickle, Oli. <laughs> oh, I didn't think I was ever gonna find you. Zoe played Big Bot Hide and Seek? You sure did. I got kind of worried. Let's find Dad and get you uninvisible. More Big Bot Hide and Seek? I'll play hide and seek with you anytime, as long as you stay visible. <laughs> hey, Dad! Hang on, Oli. I've finally fixed the Magno. A quick zappity zap, and then I'll play. Wow, Zoe! 
Okie dokie. Stain's gone. <laughs> Dad, uh, so are you. Swirling stars, I'm invisible. Daddy play Big Bot Hide and Seek? Don't worry, kids. I'll just recombobulate the color coordinator. Come on, Zoe. Let's go play. <laughs> <laughs> and tighten the visible later. <laughs> just a flick of the switch. Oh, my. <laughs> 